this video, we will explore how to find and add content to your course and unit pages in Schoolbox. First, you need to navigate to your courses area to find the course you want to add content to. You can do this by using a top menu link, such as this one called Courses. It should be noted that your school may not have this option or it may have an alternative name. If you cannot find your course list, you can speak with one of your Schoolbox super users or champions. Your course list will display all the courses created within your school. Once you find the course you would like to add content to, you can view the units of the course by selecting the down arrow. The three dot menu will give you options to import the course to classes, view the course homepage, and modify the course. For this video, we will choose to view the course homepage so that we can edit the content on the course and unit pages. This course homepage is quite bare at the moment, with some empty components. The course you may want to edit may have nothing on the page. When you access your course or unit page, a template may have been applied to the page with components already added to help you create your page. This template has been set up by your school. In the top right of the page, you will see three icons. The plus icon will open the component library for you to add components to the page. The middle icon will open up your column and color settings. Sliding the column width will adjust the width of the columns. You can change the colors of the component headings and text. You can also change colors depending on their position on the page, top, left, or right columns. Please note that some schools choose to disable these options. So if they don't appear on your page, your school has disabled this option to keep the design of pages consistent to your branding. The three dot menu allows you to perform various actions related to the page. For example, switch to student view so that you can see how students will see your page. Adding a subfolder will create a page or folder under your current page. Modify folder will give you the option to change settings such as the name or cover image of the page, as well as some other options related to the page type. Adding a folder component to the page will display the units and subunits found under the course or unit page. By clicking on these links, you will be connected to the home page for that unit or subunit. To add content to the page, you can drag and drop components from the component library onto the page. Pre-made items such as PDFs, PowerPoints and Word documents can be added to the files component by dragging and dropping. For more advice about how to add components, please watch the basic components video or refer to the component map. You will also learn more about the types of components that work well in junior school or senior school courses in coming tasks.